She was definitely wrong about that. Though. That'll be our next video, us running from snakes, <laughs> seeing what works and what gets us bit. What gets us <laughs> Well, that one didn't work. I think uh, standing there and sighting the snake, batting it on the head, yeah. that might get you bit. Oh, come on. You're not even a real snake. <laughs> Turns out it was. Try me. Try me. What were we talking about? Okay, we were talking about strategies and stuff, and we're doing good. So get the frags anytime you get a chance. Which is the even rounds on the, on the day one, or blood drop, my bad. Yeah. Yeah, you get to learn what uh, I, I don't even or odd, where the weapons are sat. That's important. Once you know that, you're pretty much good to go, and you can get better from like there. Like, uh, it's very important on stasis to know which which is what, because the boom shot and the torque and stuff. Yeah. Boom but shot's we'll, critical on that level. We'll get, we'll get to that when we get to that. So I like the destructible environments. Kudos. Yeah, that is kudos. It's really cool that someone's hiding behind a pool and you can just shoot it away and start shooting them. Yeah, they made it better because uh, Gears of War One, like uh -oh. if someone was hiding behind something, it'd be really hard to shoot them even though you could see their head. Right. Now you can like pick yeah. off the little shoulders and yeah, stuff. Yeah, which is it's pretty awesome. With the sniper and everything. See, I knocked him down, but there's a guy behind me, so I knew if I wanted to survive. I'd See, if you were a rookie, you would have just, oh, I'm gonna take the kill here, but no. Not me. I'm always in it for the win. I think I lose here, but live for another day. Wait, I think I get three of them. Oh yeah, this is amazing. Live to see another day. That's what you gotta do. Yeah, exactly. You take your time. See, don't, be not, a, don't be patient. I'm not running because I'm a pussy. I'm running because I'm trying to get good position against them, so I can pick off one and run away. Right. Watch this though. This is sweet. I get three of them. I see him throw a grenade in front of me, so I go back. I shoot one of that didn't work. He stuck me. I go down, kill three of them. Wow. And stay alive. <laughs> and then my teammate, I didn't know I had a teammate, but apparently I do. Yeah, that's what happens. All, let's see, let's see where like, he's at. Meanwhile, oh, he's hiding. <laughs> if you're one of the players that do this, fuck you. Period. I take pictures of them all and I'm going to make a little compilation. This is not a good strategy in Gears of War ever. If you ever. Gotta, if there's one of you, then it's okay. Against like three, you know. Right. If it's one or two, I'm I'm hunting for them, you know, try to pick one off. Because every time we die, we'll be fighting on like three or four people at a time, getting two or three kills, thinking we're on it by ourselves. Then we die, we got to switch to. The, there's always some idiot doing this, and completely I mean, out of the picture, just hanging out. When I'm running away from five guys, I really don't have time to push select and see how many guys I got. So right. I just figure it's me against five. And people are gonna be like, oh, well, you should wait for them or something. But if you wait for them, you're just gonna be standing around looking at each other for three hours. Yeah. And you're in no better position here than if you were running at them. Exactly. But this guy, I think, is lucky. I think he might win, actually. But that's because I took out three of them. Right. I mean, that was, I mean, that was clearly not my skill. I it's got not like this is the worst strategy, but it's just lame. And When I got a teammate, I'm I, push sick left, I push left bumper, and I look for him, and I go for him. Right. Like, this guy was nowhere to be found when you needed help. No, on the other side of the map. I mean, we probably could have taken him out of wall, because they were all looking for me, thinking there's one guy left, too. Right. You could have came up behind him. Yeah, see, he got him there, but I mean, he could have gotten five minutes earlier, really. I mean, and what if I didn't take out three guys? Then he would have been doing the same stupid crap, and there would have been four people, and he would have been screwed. He would have been up the creek without a paddle. Yep, nothing but a ping pong table and a jellyfish. Exactly. What kind of creek is that? A weird one. Shit creek. Shit creek. <laughs> Back road. <laughs> Back road. Shit creek. Bush league. Bush league. Um, I wish you could sit on the benches in this game. But yeah, I think that would be added bonus. Like they would think, oh, he's just a pedestrian. Don't don't hurt yeah. him. Yeah, or maybe your legs get tired for a minute. Yeah, I mean, I do a lot of running. I like uh, if you go on the leaderboards, it shows you how much you've uh, been in um, roadie run mode. Roadie run? What? Uh, whatever they call it, but it's just where you're running. Mm. I mean, they did that in Call of Duty Four, so that's probably where they got it. You got oh, that. and I hate the golden guns. Anybody that has the golden gun, you're an idiot. It looks yeah. terrible. It ruins the art of the game. Everything. Yeah, it does take away from the uh, atmosphere. It so just looks stupid. I feel like I'm playing like an arcade game from like the early '90s. Like, yeah, the what? I understand you want to think that people are, oh, you got the limited edition. You're so freaking cool. Oh yeah. All right, we did too, but we don't use the golden gun because it looks terrible. Yeah, it does. The, the way I see it is, um, look at that. I got away from three of them. It's for the nerds who want to oh. think they're sweet. Don't really care what the game looks like. They just want to show how sweet they are by paying ten bucks. Definitely the tracks away from the uh, the uh, grudge of the game or the yeah. treasury. Oh, it's the end of the world. and We're fighting for mankind. There's a guy with a ridiculous looking golden gun running around. I mean, let's give him a two million dollar golden gun. This guy needs it. Not only is the gun golden, but if you look, the clips are golden as well. Mm. So imagine how much they spent on that. Thank you, Epic, for giving that feature so all the idiots in the world I feel it's necessary to. Use that. Let's see if I get picked up. I might. Nope. And we're gonna get so many comments like, dude, the golden gun's sweet. Oh, uh, they get picked up. Thank you, mate. 
And I don't. I never chainsaw unless I got the lancer out. Actually, I don't even use the lancer anymore. I use the hammer burst because it's so ridiculous powerful. Yeah, this video was made before we realized the hammer burst is better than the, the which, lancer. Yeah, which I'm not the only one. A lot of uh, higher level of people use the hammer burst because it's so ridiculous. I mean, you can run. down people if you have a good teamwork. Two people with a hammer burst with active reload, like 0.5 seconds, they're down. Yeah. So there you go, there's us playing, talking about some strategies. Oh yeah, I didn't end that match because I didn't figure you need to see it, but we won, even though it was 5 on 4. So anywho, there's Blood Drive, and uh, we're going to keep it moving. We'll have uh, the next level up in a jiffy. In a jiffy. Have a glorious evening and get your gears on, sirs. Get your gears on. Women's and see, sirs. See you later. Peace.